Okay, and I am back. Yeah, it doesn't look like I've missed anything in the chat. Good. Uh, let me go ahead and reset my death counter to zero. And new game plus. A true challenge for the strongest vampire hunter. Are you sure you want to continue? Give it to me, daddy! Oh, look at that! Even the sky box is dynamically colored depending on the difficulty. That's pretty neat. Now you watch, it'll probably be like nightmare mode with respawning enemies. Oh! Boons! Okay. Yeah, that's new. These guys weren't here before. Ha! They even put one right in front of the lever. Noise. Oh no, the peeping eyes. Yeah, I think this is like the ultra violence mode. Ooh, a gold zombie. How many enemies, by the way? Almost a hundred. Wait a minute. Was that... Was that the Nova Skeleton? Looked a lot like it. Oh no. We're getting Nova Boners now, boys. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Oh wait, you stay you can hit him. Huh. Last time I tried hitting the bats, I couldn't kill them normally. Huh. Uh, what's in this one? Stopwatch. Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna be taking that. I also just noticed I have so many hearts right now. It's not even funny. Oh no, ectoplasms! Get me out of here! Oh boy, wasn't expecting to see these guys. Uh, I forget what they're called in the Castlevania games. I think in Symphony in the Night, they were called Cthulhu's? They were either called Cthulhu's or Devils. Ugh.
I gotta say, this is way more interesting with the new enemies. Uh, I'm keeping the dagger for right now. If I need the holy water, I know where it's at. Oh! That, well, never mind. Kind of blew that opportunity. I kind of blew my chances there. I, I know there's a peeping eye up there. Somewhere. I see you. Come here. I ain't coming out there. Now you're, gonna, you're gonna play it that way, huh? I can wait. It, it's just gonna stay out there. And yes, and yes, I'm pretty sure those skeletons are shooting blazers out of their crotch. That's how it originally was in the uh, Symphony in the Night game. Gotta watch where I step. Mm. I know there's some more out here, right? Well, if I'm missing any enemies, um, I'll have to come back out here later. Okay. Yeah, you go ahead and go grab some food. I'll probably still be on this stage when you get back. Well, I guess if people were to make custom maps for this mod, at least now I know there will be more of a diverse monster variety. 
that people can use. Rather than just like spamming eagles everywhere, or bats everywhere, they'll be able to spam, say, ectoplasms. And let's get rid of the Nova Boner. Uh, yeah, this time I'm keeping the dagger. Because I know I'm going to need it now. It's going to be impossible to take out the enemies in that room with just the holy water. Between the Nova Skeletons and that one peeping eye in there, yeah, it's a little busy. Maybe now there will be some wall meat hidden in here? Nah, still money. Yeah, whatever, I'll take it. But yeah, in terms of the level architecture so far, it doesn't really seem like anything's changed. Just the enemy positions. Hey, hey the Bible! Now that sub weapon wasn't available before. But I know in the original Castlevania games, it wasn't that good. <laughs> yep, I knew that was coming. Eyes are AIDS. <laughs> Just kind of AIDS. Is that an all Raoon? Yes, it is. All right.
Get wrecked, babe. Get wrecked by my erection. I'm sorry, I had... I had to say that. Oh, you hit me through the wall? Oh, that's bad. Hi. I'll keep that there for right now. Is that what I think it is? Yes, it is. Oh, those zombies just got friggin' obliterated. That's great. Just leave that there. I wonder what new critters we have down in here. Hi there, Silent Hill Billy. You're dying. Oh shit. Somebody help Billy. Quick. I mean, there's not much I can do. Oh, you're now? Okay. Ah, uh, so yeah, welcome to Castlevania Doom. Well, hey, you picked a good stream. Uh, I think whenever Dave gets back, he might be able to give you a little bit of beer. Or wine. I'm pretty sure he only drinks wine. He might drink beer, though. I'm not sure. See your hand poking out over there. Nah, it's fine. What did a blue merman do anyway? I know the orange ones just shoot normal fireballs. Me, personally, I enjoy the Metroidvanias more. But I do also enjoy the classic games. Uh, the best Castlevania game? In terms of Metroidvanias, I'd probably say... Well, Symphony of the Night, obviously. Or no, Nocturne in the Moonlight. Sorry. That, that one is basically Symphony of the Night, but with more content. 
Um, in terms of original Castlevania, though, I probably have to say Castlevania 4, just because of how fluent of how fluid the controls are. I mean, it's kind of hard to say, though, to be honest. I mean, there's not really that many bad Castlevania games out there. I mean, I can't think of a few. Ahem, <clears throat> Castlevania The Adventure. But even that game had good music. You know what, I'm not going to worry about killing everything, I'm just going to try to get through the stages. Oh crap, I forgot to get the wall meat. You know what, I might not even need it. The keyword here being might. I might not need it. Well, I'm kicking this bat's ass right now. That went better than expected. Yeah, I've heard Castlevania 64 isn't that good. Between the clunky controls, the camera... And I guess I'd have to play it for myself, though, to see what it's like. Okay, stage one completed. I guess I could just go ahead and give myself the leather whip. And yeah, I basically have to do this every time I want to start with just the leather whip and no sub weapons. Why, you may ask? I mean, other than just for a greater challenge, I suppose. I mean, that's the only reason I can think of. Get out of here, bat. Down, boy. Said get down. There we go. Actually, you know what item I haven't seen in this? Uh, the medicine jar from Castlevania 1. Or the item that makes you invincible. You know what? I might see it on this mode. 
because there was actually another item I saw in the previous stage that wasn't in full moon mode. So it might be exclusive to just this difficulty. Oh. Hmm. Oh yeah. The NES Castlevanias were really just rough. And yeah, it's mainly because of the controls. Really, we got these little guys running around? Oh, how many hits do you take, bud? I'm gonna say two. But yeah, I know what you mean. You really don't have any control over your character while you're in the air. <laughs> Speaking of Medusas. Oh, Loveless, hey. Welcome, everyone. Hope you're all having a good evening. Hey, Loveless, have you tried out this mod yet? It's pretty dank. You bet I am. I mean, it's Castlevania and Doom. How could I not be having fun? Oh, snap. Oh, come on. How did that not hit either of you? little too close for comfort there, buddy. Yeah, as you can tell, I've already played through this once on an easier difficulty, so I kind of know what to expect. The key word here being kind of. Man, they are really generous with the hearts here on the uh, Blood Moon difficulty. That might be for the better. Oh dear, Dave. Well, hey, at least none of it got in your eye. And yes, that actually has happened to me before. It was kind of painful. That's an interesting bit of info there, Billy. I'm not even sure if I've ever heard of that band. Well, yet again, you said they are Irish. So that's probably why. All right, guys, brace yourselves. For this is an awesome Easter egg. Oh, 
Hi, Jimmy. Hey, Billy knows who that is. Actually, I'm pretty sure everybody here knows who that is. And Mr. Zul had to come in with the AIDS command and ruin everything. Thank you. Okay, joking aside. Time, Mr. Zul. Oh, snap. Hey, have you played this mod yet? Okay, well, you do have a point. Uh, yeah, it's a little sound effect my buddy Trevor came up with. Or 43-bit, as he's known as here on Twitch. Basically, the whole AIDS thing is just like a little inside joke between me and him. And that sound effect is usually played whenever I'm in kind of an annoying situation, such as with the Medusa heads back there. You know, I'm really tempted to pick up that Bible just to see what it does. I really don't want to pick it up, though. Actually, what's the pattern again? Okay. Oh, no, 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 I do not need that right now. Get out of here, you. Oh, no. Nuh-uh. Imps. What else is up here? Oh, God. That's a lot of nope. Yeah, I think I remember hearing that somewhere before. I'm just more associated with those words being used as a meme. I'll take the wall meat. Yeah. Wait, why can I? Oh, I maxed out my heart counter. Well, oh, that's the first. I'd highly recommend it. It's actually a lot of fun. What kind of pizza did you get, Mr. Zul? It better not have pineapple on it. Pepperoni and green peppers? Oh, okay. That's not too bad, then. 
Yeah, there's actually some people out there that have... Oh, what? Uh, uh, huh? Did I just get insta-boned by that skeleton? You saw that, right? I was in full health. And I instantly died. Now that's bullshit. Oh well. At least we get to see this again. And no, you can't collect it. Okay, I'm gonna be switching to the dagger here. Man, this is so far back, too. Uh, you know what? Give me that wall meat. Oh, you actually like pineapple on your pizza, Dave. Hmm. How did I... I think you may have triggered Douglas, uh, Dave. Uh, my name? Like my I IRL name? Uh, just Matt. Wow, I am taking all the fireballs here like a champ. I think it actually says in my, uh, channel description. Uh, two T's in my name, but thank you. My name is not Oscar. I don't even know anyone named Oscar. You know what? Give me the Bible. Let's see what it does. Oh. It's just a shield. Kind of. Hey, Loveless. You missed me getting insta-boned. So, Loveless, have you played this yet? I think I already asked you that. Wow, this Bible is actually a pretty good weapon. Yeah, Loveless is actually another person on here that plays Doom. He usually, he usually plays more of the slaughtery stuff. So, if you're into playing Doom and watching thousands of monsters get slaughtered, go to his channel.
Man, this Bible is a nice weapon. Now this save is just in case I die to the skeleton again. Here, look at my health. I'm at half right now, okay? Oh, okay. Nope, that time I'm fine. Never mind. Please tell me somebody clipped that. Oh, snap. We got a double. Uh, Terraria? Uh, I mean, I haven't played it in like the past month. Mainly because I've been busy with Doom stuff. Come on, what are you doing? I'll forget you. But no, I haven't stopped playing Terraria completely. Um, as a matter of fact, one of my buddies on Twitch actually wanted to play that again sometime here. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save here anyway. Uh, I think the last time I did something in Terraria... Oh, what was it? I think I did a boomerang and flail only playthrough. Ever since then, I haven't really done much in it, though. Oh, dude, that hurt. Also, is this going to be my new nickname now? Oscar. I mean, hey, I've been called worse. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take the name Oscar. Mm. Oh, there's a dagger again if I want that. I think I'll keep the Bible for the time being, though. This is a pretty nice weapon. No, 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 no. Okay, well, that kind of happened. And the reason I'm not jumping down here, by the way, is because you take fall damage in this mod. So I know I could just ignore that one enemy altogether and just jump straight down here. But I'll end up losing a big chunk of health. Whoa! That was close. Okay, I think I got it. Ah, uh, so Loveless, what were you playing tonight? I mean, I know you were playing Doom, obviously. But, like, what match set were you playing? I think I'm boned. And I, to, to. I was gonna ask him to kill me. Boom, baby! I'm doing that just so I don't have to go and kill him every time. Him, her, it. Uh, but yeah, so far, I've actually played through this mod once completely. Uh, when was it? Like, uh, 45 minutes ago, I believe, according to OBS. 
Um, on hard mode, it's actually pretty fun. Uh, stage 5 gets pretty challenging, though, if you don't know what's coming up. Oh wait, does the Bible follow me? I think it does. Yes, it does follow me. That's pretty cool. Here, I thought the Bible, once you summoned the Bible, it would just stay in one place. Well, that's kind of neat. Oh, snap. Who gave me a host? Hey, John. Thank you for that. Hope you're having a good morning. Morning, evening, whatever time it is in your area. <laughs> I don't know. I've been whipping it good since 8 p.m. It is now 1 a.m. So I've been whipping it good for about four hours now. This is currently my second playthrough of this game. Uh, right now I'm playing it on New Game Plus, so there's basically more enemies. Uh, I'll save here at the current position. Okay, the Bible isn't as effective against bosses. Confirmed. Let's see if I can do this without dying. Yep, did it. I know you still have to play this, John, but I'd highly recommend it. Even though it has pissed me off a couple of times, it's still a great mod. Uh, okay, let the text fade out. Uh, you do have the weak guns off though, right John? Okay, at least you have the weak guns to look forward to then. All I can tell you to do is to- Oh God! No, not to- Oh God. <laughs> is to get her done. Still not that many enemies. I was expecting the monster count to jump up to like a hundred some here. Now that's spooky. What are you doing? Oh no. Now we got ones that throw knives.
Um, I don't work at the moment. Okay, this is going to be a bit rough. We might be here for a few. Yeah, first we had the regular bone throwing skeletons, and now we have skeletons that shoot lasers out of their crotch. Well, the Nova skeletons only appear on the Blood Moon difficulty, which is like the hardest. It even says New Game Plus. So if you're playing for your first time, I'd recommend Full Moon, in which case they don't appear on Full Moon mode. As a matter of fact, a lot of the enemies you're seeing here don't appear on Full Moon. Uh, the giant skulls, the ectoplasms, the devils that shoot the three fireballs, the snipers, which we'll be seeing in the next tower coming up. Oh yeah, and these little buggers too. The little flea men to throw daggers at you. I think they're called Rippers. In Portrait of Ruin. Oh, okay, I did get that skeleton. Yeah, here are the snipers. Ah. That little flea man with the dodges, though. Okay, I don't know how I'm gonna do this room. Um, I got a Nova Skeleton up there in beans. I got a sniper to deal with. I got a little flea man over there, which really won't do much. I guess all I can do is just go at it. Come on! Mm. I can't hit him from here, can I? Hmm. Yeah, on the full moon difficulty, it's actually not that bad. Okay. Catch you later, Douglas. Uh, thank you for stopping by. Uh, the only part that gave me trouble on Full Moon uh, was the end of Stage 5. Because there's this long hallway with a bunch of Medusa heads flying around and you have two Axe Knights to deal with. And then right after that you have to fight the Grim Reaper. Thankfully you can get some of your health restored via Wallmate. Oh, that's right, you're playing the Alfonso. Yes, it is Market Anarchy, and it kicks ass. Lots of it. And it also kind of kicks my ass. But that's okay. Because I'm actually having fun with this. Oh, by the way, Market Anarchy. Are you still gonna make that Bubble Bobble mod? I remember you'd mentioned that whenever I streamed your map. Ah. 
wasn't sure if I made that or not. Hmm. All right. You know what? Come here. Come here, Nova Boner. Enough for you. Yeah, I'm currently playing this on the uh, New Game Plus difficulty. As you can tell, it's really hectic. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I know that feeling. When you're working on several projects at once. Speaking of which, I still have to finish my slaughter map. Or no, no, wait a minute. That's right, I did finish it. Um, I didn't playtest it then. I kind of gave it the Loveless uh, playtest. Oh, snap. Gotta play it slow and steady now. Unless the raven killed itself. Never mind. I'm just kind of waiting for this little imp to get over here. Mmm. Come here. Come here! The imps and the peeping eyes, man. They can get the... 31 maps of December. Jeez. So what, is this gonna be like a bunch of little speed maps? Pretty much. Whoa. That was a nice shot there, Nova, Nova Boner. See, with me, I always end up playtesting the shit out of my maps, and I always spend so much time worrying about the detail that even making a small map takes a fair amount of time, like, I'd want to say a couple days. Oh, come on, dude. Alright, the sniper's gotta go. Come here. Man. Ah. Alright. I hope you guys like this one tune, because you're probably going to be listening to it for uh, quite a while. Alright, that was terrible. Yeah, it is terrible. Hold on. YOLO!
Oh, by the way, I know this hasn't happened in a couple of hours, but if the stream suddenly starts lagging, buffering, dropping frames, or anything along those lines, um, it's probably because Comcast is doing something. Uh, my internet's been kind of shutting on and off all evening. I don't know what's up. Ah, dude, that flea man just trolled me so hard. Uh, okay, I think I'm gonna save once I get to that room. For a while there, I was kind of keeping the role of I'll only save at keys. But I don't want to bore you guys. Yeah, that Nova Skeleton up there is pretty much my worst enemy right now. And a Flame Man, kinda. Because I can get stuck on him. Hey, Sir Anderson, thank you for the host. I hope you're having a good evening. Man, I'm getting a lot of attention right now. Dude, this mod kicks ass. I've already finished the game once on an easier difficulty. Now I'm playing it again on New Game Plus. And I gotta say, while it is a lot harder, I'm still having fun with it. Ah! Ah! I mean, it's not like Soten, if that's what you're expecting. This is more or less classic Katya. But even then, it's still awesome. And I'd highly recommend downloading it. Alright. And because I am a complete nooblet, I'm going to save right here. You watch, now I'll get through this in like one... Uh, hello? Hello? Getting sniped at by multiple skeletons here. Uh, I'll go back for the torches in a second. Oh no, 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 no. Are you serious, dude? Bye bye, crow. Did I kill that devil? Uh, Lament of Innocence was kind of more like Harmony of Dissonance, I'd want to say, and that was more like a Metroidvania. Ah. So yeah, that's not really a classic Castlevania game, I'd say. But Lament of Innocence was pretty good. Or at least I thought it was. Ah! The crow again. Yeah, I, I forgot to take out the crow. Okay. Did I kill it? Okay, think I got it. Hmm. 
Man, I think I used to have trouble with just the bone pillars. And I got all these fancy new enemies to worry about. But seriously though, you haven't played any of the uh, classic Castlevania games? Like Castlevania 4, 3, 1? I know I kind of skipped 2 there. Well, that made things a lot easier. Um, don't punch me. It's hard. Oh, something's hitting me. Hello? Ah, yeah. Little bat. I mean, this might be kind of obvious, but if you're playing the original Castlevania games for, like, uh, NES... Um... Yeah, get ready for a rough time, because they're pretty hard. I mean, they're not bad, though. Ah! <laughs> no. That's what I was trying to do. Uh, what makes the original Castlevania games tough, though, are the controls. It's just because they're so stiff. That and another problem is that you really can't control your character while you're in midair. The only game I know of that kind of doesn't have that issue is Super Castlevania 4. So if you were to play any of the original classic Castlevania games, I would probably suggest the fourth game. Ah! Uh, uh, uh. Oh! Yes, Dave, I, I said stiff. I said the S word. Can I hit that skull? There we go. <laughs> nah, that's fine, dude. I get what you mean. I know that raven is out there somewhere. It didn't hit me, and I know I didn't kill it, so I know it's still out there. I think. Hit that guy from over here. Nice.
Yeah, I'm glad they give you all these hearts to use on Blood Moon difficulty. Because it doesn't seem like I'm relying on the whip much anymore. Come on, there's two of them. Eh, probably, Dave. I would not be surprised. I know there's a sniper up there. I see you back there. Well, turd, come here. Keep my axe right for right now, thank you. Uh, as you can say, I've kind of gotten used to this, but I don't know if they've changed anything for this one area. Uh, well, I don't notice any changes here. Yep, never mind. Fall back. Fall back. Uh, oh my god, those Medusas are gonna kill me, aren't they? Yeah, Harmony of Dissonance was kind of the same way. Ex uh, instead of orbs, though, they were spellbooks. Like, there was an ice one, a fire one, light, dark, thunder, etc. You're gonna play like that, aren't you, Sniper? Oh boy. This is like Castlevania 3 difficulty right here. It's got all this crap coming after you. And yes, I know I didn't save after doing that one area. I was low on health, I didn't want to save. So I'm gonna try to do this again. Hopefully not lose as much health. Although I think those plans are already out of the window. It's even worse that the uh, Nova Skeletons don't really have a pattern. It's like fire randomly. So it's like, you know, I could be right up next to the guy and then next thing you know, he ends up shooting his laser at me. I think that's normal Doom monster behavior though. Wow, I got lucky with that one sniper.
Mm. There's a skeleton up there. Alright, I got a lot of health. I think this would be a good opportunity to save. I mean, I've been going for four hours now. So you gotta understand that I might be getting a little, you know, fatigued. But not to the point of where I'm getting pissed off at every little thing. So I'm still good for the time being. Although those snipers are kind of giving me AIDS. I think I'm going to be using the stopwatch a lot more often here. I mean, hey, I have plenty of hearts. So there's no reason I can't. So far, I seem to be doing good, though. You watch, now I'll walk off a ledge. you not die from that? And yes, I kind of realize I'm spamming the stopwatch here. I mean, you can't blame me, right? Uh, I'll keep the stopwatch for right now. Or I could just get stabbed. That also works. Oh, by the way, Oscar is my nickname now. Um, apparently Dave, for whatever reason, decided to give me the name Oscar, so, yeah. You, you can call me that for right now. And I'll be totally fine with it. Oh yeah, they were like the first buddies I've ever really made on Twitch.
first I became friends with a dude named Ty88. And then eventually Bodilla Godzilla. DOS and then Animal Attack. Ah, the amount of admiration I have for this here stopwatch. Ah, the voices in your head chose the name, okay. <laughs> wow now. probably stick with the stopwatch from now on. <laughs> I just kick so much ass with it. Then it actually makes me use the whip. Uh, I do remember in the room coming up here, there's a cross necklace I can get. <laughs> Cheat mode. Oh, you're going to bed, Dave. All right. Well, I'll catch you later. Uh, thank you for stopping by. Jeez. Well, I nearly died there. Oh yeah, I think it actually is pretty late where Dave is. Uh, I think when he said he started watching me, it was, it was at around 1.30 a.m. in his place. So yeah, he's been here for a while. Oh well, it gives me a reason to keep going. Oh by the way, Sir Anderson. No, no, if you want cheat mode, here's what you can do. You can wake up the enemies in here. Close the door. And then while the door is closed, you can just kill enemies from the other side. Like, I'm not even joking, that's an actual thing. That's cheating. Was this here before? I don't remember this being here originally. But yeah, it's kind of a cheesy little tactic. That and it wasn't originally intended. So for me, that's cheating. Using the stopwatch is not cheating because, you know, it's like something you can originally obtain in the game. It's something you're meant to have, something you can use. I'd like a stopwatch for Doom. It's like you step into a huge slaughter fest type area. And then you can just use the stopwatch. And then run around and do whatever, try to find an escape or whatnot. Uh, okay, still nothing up here. 
Oh! Hi there. I was not expecting to see a bone dragon this early. That's the dagger. I don't want that. I do want the wall meat, however. I will gladly take that. Okay, now I can either cheese the boss or I can fight it normally using a cross. Or the dagger. You know what? I'll try fighting it with the cross, just to be fair. I am not using the daggers against the uh, mummies. Or I could use the axe. I haven't really tried using the axe on the mummies yet. I know the axe worked pretty well against Dracula. see which one okay save on that oh my goodness that's a lot of damage Yeah, the axe is still up, dude. Here we go. Ah, oh, that felt good. I kind of hope that went through the microphone. Take Vampire Killer 3. Take Token Axe. And yes, I am playing each level from a quote-unquote leather whip start. It's basically the equivalent to uh, Doom's pistol starts. But instead of a pistol, you get a whip. Oh no, the gastropods. And a Nova Boner. Come here. Get bone. Oh goodness. I'm gonna be the one that gets boned here if I don't move it. Holy crap. I still got killed. Hmm. But yeah, this is a really extremely, like, well done mod. I was actually thinking about wanting to make custom maps just for this. Uh, 
Uh, how many enemies? Oh my! We hit the big two o o people. Well, what you're talking about there with some vials is a map set. Well, I guess this is also technically a map set. But yeah, this basically alters the gameplay mechanics entirely. And this is the kind of stuff I wish the Doom community would output more. Rather than just like well, as you said, these huge slaughter fest type maps. I mean, when I first joined the Doom community, I thought those were awesome. But nowadays, I just kind of look at them like, nah, that is not my cup of tea. Not saying I hate slaughter maps entirely. I'm just not as into them as I used to be when I first join the Doom community. Ooh, I there. I'm gonna have to go get the axe for this one, aren't I? Okay, you know what, Nova Boner? It's out of your crap. Get boned. And that's why I've also been looking forward to playing some other gameplay alteration mods, such as uh, Doomed Golden Souls, uh, Pirate Doom, maybe Project Brutality? I don't know. We'll have to see about that one. Merman. That skeleton! <laughs> no. Another thing I also kind of wanted to check out later was speedruns for this one mod. I mean, hey, I've seen people speedrun modded Doom before, so why not this one? I think I might have to redo this one area. Yeah, that was just terrible. Um, have I played Sh Strange Aeons? I think I've heard of that mod. 
It sounds familiar. Well, I mean, hey, if it's not as bad as, say, No Chance or Hell Revealed 2, I'd be willing to try it out. Happily. Yeah, the axe? Uh, nah. Okay, I'm glad I didn't take the axe yet. Oh yeah, Fava Beans is another one I've heard of. Uh, I think that's more vanilla based though, as it only modifies maps. And I think it adds some new textures. I usually enjoy the older stuff. So yeah, I might have to check it out. I think I watched John Sweet P do a playthrough of it. And said playthrough is like old, I think. Hey, thank you for the follow, Sir Anderson. You know, I just thought of it now, but I probably should have had my uh, notifer. Notifer. My notification alerts changed to be Castlevania themed. By the way, please excuse my words. Sometimes they don't come out right. And it only costs one heart per use. That's awesome. Yeah, this thing basically makes me invincible. And there goes the Z-Doom demon flying off into the sunset. No, I do not want the holy water. I do not want that. I want to keep my precious Bible. Alright, I think we cleared out a room. I think that deserves a save. Oh, what? Oh, that's right, I think there's a skeleton up there. Crap. Oh, no. 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 I will not die. Not now. Man, I'm like one hit away from death. Oh my god. Yep, there we go. 
You know what? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go take a whiz. I'll be right back. Okay. I am back and my bladder is now empty. Let's go. Eh, whatever. They could take a bit of a beating. Probably reach out if I were to stand up here. I don't even know why I'm trying to get it. It's not like you can get to me. I think. These things are basically like the pain elementals of Castlevania. Killing them is almost as bad as letting them live. Whoa! Hi there. Hi there, big boy. I actually wonder if Mega Blast played this mod yet. I haven't been seeing him stream lately. 
I think somebody said he still does, though. It's just, like, really late into the night. I think it was Mr. Zool that told me. It was either Mr. Zool or Market. You know what? It's not hurting anything. I'm just gonna let it go. up there, Mr. Skelly. Mr. Spooky Scary Skeleton. Sending shivers down my spine. Is this a whip upgrade? No, it's cross. Eh, I'll keep my Bible. Ah, poop. I don't think I... Yeah, I can't reach that skeleton from down here. That fella is way too high up. No, not this time. Yeah, I'm probably not going to try to go for UV Max for a change. I was doing that before, and when I got to stage 6, I couldn't kill all of the giant bats at the beginning. So at that point, I just kind of said the hell with UV Max. It, it's not worth it. Wait, can I hit these guys from here? Yeah, some of them. Yeah, got it. I think this is where I have to go next, isn't it? Oh no, that's the red key door. Crap. Saving it under the uh, save scum slot. Because I am bad at Doom. <laughs> Come on, Nekdi, what are you doing? I wish enemies could end fight with each other in this mod. Make life a little easier. For me, anyways. <sighs> Goes on the health.
Oh, wow, I was actually able to get him. Ah, she got me anyway. Just trying to be really careful there, too. Ah, I can't wait to see, see uh, stage five. That's going to be a real joy. A real walk in the park. No. Bad boner. Been using the Bible like crazy and still I'm at 90 hearts. That is amazing. I used up my only wall meat. So, this is pretty much all I have. Actually, I didn't check the start. Is there anything back here? Uh, I don't see anything. Crap. Nope. Never mind. Got some more wall meat right here. Jumped right on top of that. Oh, hey, a thorny bush or a thorny plant. Let me sit on it. <laughs> uh, what's up here? Yeah, just a regular old boner. Not a bloody boner, not a Nova boner, just, just your average every day. White. Okay, I really gotta stop. <laughs> I really gotta stop with the boner jokes. Probably getting old. Ah, you little turd.
I wonder how much the courtyard has changed. And I still didn't get the axe. You know what? I don't need it. Ooh, I do need the whip upgrade, however. Everything just friggin' drops when they're in front of me. This Bible is OP. There's a thorn weed. I was waiting for one to pop up there. many large hearts and I'll probably be needing all of them yet again maybe not I wonder how this weapon will work against old Frankie I imagine it'll stun lock him to hell and back. Okay, you know what? This area hasn't been that bad. I'll just go ahead and load from my current position. I'll play it a little fair right now. I'll let that be my punishment for abusing the Bible.
Whoa, wait, she can actually hit me from this far? I guess she can. A zombie got me even with the Bible. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> all right, all right. You know what? I think I'll switch to the axe. Just to make things a little less boring. Oh no, but yet, give me a cross. on the over. Oh no. No, 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 no. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not even worried about them dropping the fleamen. I'm just worried about the eagles themselves. They're nasty. Oh god, these things are also nasty, speaking of. I kind of wish the Bone Dragon would drop like 10 gold bags or 10 hearts upon death, like in the original game.
Alright, replenished on hearts. And back out into the fray. I have a feeling I'm gonna regret getting rid of that Bible. I quit being AIDS. Thank you. Uh, so what killed me last time? Oh, that's right. I was in the big room. Oh crap, it actually can get in here. Hi. And goodbye. Zombos in here. No, but there is a couple rippers up there that are gonna rip my stomach out. If I am not careful. Yeah, yeah. Yep, one got stuck again. Cool. why that happens. Is it just because their hitbox is so small or what? Either way, I think it's funny and I welcome it. I thought there was a black panther in here somewhere. Now, I can say.
It's like I don't even try to get them stuck on there. It just kind of happens. No! Oh no. Wait, I think. No, I took the cross. God damn it. I guess I could go back and pick up the holy water. I mean, that's my only other option at this point. Is I am now using the daggers against Frankenstein. There's a bag of gold over here before. Is that the crouch? How'd I get it? Eh, whatever. Yeah, yeah, I'll go get the holy water. I also like it that you can open up the door either way. Position. I'll save it under save scum for right now. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay, the holy water just demolishes Frankenstein. Even then, I barely made it out alive. Next boss is the big old Grim Reaper. But first I gotta get through stage five. Wow, no dropped frames. And now that I said that, I'm probably gonna drop a bunch of frames. Alright, what do we got? We got a Ripper, we got a Devil, we got... Peeping Eye! I think we got a Boner. Yep, we got a Boner.
impaled dog heads on a pole. I'm fine with killing the whole humans ordeal thing, but when Dracula starts killing animals, then I get pissed. Eh. Yeah, I forgot about the peeping eye in here. <sighs> Let's see how stage five holds up on the stiff quality. Isn't there Akubax in here? Akubox, however you say her names. I know some of them are supposed to appear here. Yep, there they are. Bang. Ah, oh, crap. All right, now I'm in trouble. going over that railing, boy. That's the last thing I need right now. Ah, oh, come on, again? get stuck on that. That hurt. Yeah, those little guys don't fuck around, do they? I might have to cheese them. No. Wait for me.
Okay, I think I got him. Oh no, I didn't have to still one up here. Yep, I'm probably dead. Ah, uh, man, it's like the third time now. All right, I think if I get another flawless first room here, I'm gonna save. This is one of the rougher levels in the game. That's kind of crappy. Something tells me I should really kill that. Because if I don't, it's going to come back and bite me in the ass later. Or I could just get killed by an Akubak again. Okay. Yep, that's all they do. They just bounce along the walls all day. Setting everything on fire. Ah, it could have been flawless, too. But the flea man had to ruin it. It could have been the run. Okay, I was just thinking, no, I, I might not even have to worry about the big devil guy in there, but no. Oh my god, really? A peeping eye that time? Uh, at least it wasn't an Aquabat. 
do something different. Oh, I almost had that one out come back. Just gotta keep throwing holy water in there. And try not to get killed by a, the Nova Boner. Yep, nope, too late for that. I know I'm just kind of making it sound like I'm complaining at this point, but I really have nothing else to talk about. Trust me, I'm trying to keep it interesting. You come over here, buddy? Over here? Yeah? Here? No? No? We'll screw you too then. I ain't moving them from this spot that I think is dead. And save scum because I am a complete new boy. You watch, peeping eye will kill me. Nope, or not. Or, or a zombie could just ruin everything. Good job, bud. Yay, yay, yay. Not today. Mm. I forget which one it's in. Oh no, it's not in this one. I think it's the next room over. Ah, man. I really don't want to continue from that one point. Hey, give me a minute here, peeps.
Ah, damn. I cannot use the rush tactic here. That is not gonna work. No, no, no. Oh, you little, you little tarb. I forgot about that. Nope, not a bat, not a bat, uh -uh. nope. Nope. Not a flea man either, please. I think I'm in even worse condition now. Uh, okay, never mind. Akubao ruined it. Man, those old guys are annoying. They're AIDS. Speaking of AIDS. I'm just gonna go ahead and let everything kill me. It's that Nova Skeleton that's getting to me. It takes down a lot of my life. I'm just going to be patient this time. I'm going to wait for everything to come to the door.
No, 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 let me out. It's, little, it's this little bastard I'm afraid of. This enemy is AIDS. This thing is like the Archvile's younger brother. I made it to this point again, except this time I have a lot of health. Oh my god, I finally did it. I cleaned out two rooms. There's only 104 enemies on this map. Bloody hell. Most of them are probably Peeping Eyes, Akubox, and Axe Armors, huh? Trying to kill the axe, so I'm always trying to kill these things. Eh. Yeah. Uh, come at me. Yeah, whatever.
69 hearts. Ah, oh, no, no, not these things. All right, nope, well, I know what to do. Just hide on the other side of the door, wait for them to head over this way, and just comb through the door. And whatever else is on the door. Alright, there we go. Isn't there an imp in here? I think I also may have died. Oh, I'm in bad shape. Oh, when did I save last? I don't remember when that was. This is gonna be rough. Okay, that's not even the right way. be more peeping aids in here. some of my health back. Took a while to get here, but I did it. It, it. 
it. Oh no. I ain't going anywhere until I kill that Akubak. Oh my god, I hate this enemy. It is like the Archival of Castlevania Doom. <gasps> the Bible! Okay, the run has been saved. We got the Bible. Save here just in case. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can go right through the railing. Huh. Interesting. Hey, remember that save I made earlier? Probably gonna be loading from there if this is too far back. Stinky cheese. Dude, I will piss myself if I lose the Bible.
This poor blood skeleton's getting murdered over and over again. rough. I don't think there's really a safe spot to stand in either. No, don't give me the cross, please. I do not want the cross. Ah, you fuck. Oh goody, and I'm dropping frames. Well, there goes a single segmented run. Or a single segment stream. Eh, I say just give it a minute. Oh, that's not worth it. wanted was a single segmented stream. Is that too much to ask? Comcast. Oh my god. I will finish this tonight, damn it. Dropped frames or not.
And finally, a legit save. Alright. Alright, let's see what they did to the halls. No, nothing. Now, if anything, the hall has actually became easier thanks to the Bible. Alright, let's see how fast we can kill death. After that, I may have to restart the stream because Comcast is being a butt again. Oh yeah, Serious Cacodemon is right. That kind of does look like Elvis. Well, I guess I'm not gonna have a choice here. I'm gonna have to play this offline. I don't know how I survived that. And it really sucks too. Same exact point. Stage five. Well, no, last time it was stage six. The very beginning of stage six. Nope, gotta wait for the text to fade out. And save. Both upgrades off the bat. Alright. Yeah, that's cool. Now, the axe. Roar to stopwatch. I think I might go with the stopwatch for a change. Oh. Bruiser Brothers? Oh, they gave me a bruising. Alright. Oh my god. Save under the new blit. Save. I mean, that wasn't really hard, I guess. I just don't want to have to do that every time. I'm kind of glad I chose a stopwatch for this. But yeah, this is basically going to be the same deal as if I was streaming online. Minus the interaction with chat. Man, that was a real waste. Crap.
You know, if my internet connection could have been a little more stable. Just for the final part. I would have been fine with all this. Hell, it would have been really hilarious if it lasted all the way up to Dracula. And then as soon as I killed Dracula in his third form, then my internet would just cut out. Like, that'd be hilarious. But, nope. Had to get cut short. Thanks, Comcast. Grade A Limburger cheese right here. Come on, I was in this fun before. There we go. Okay, that is not a wedge. I was say I could cheese this even further. There we go. Oh, hang on a minute. I almost forgot about this little area back here. Assuming I can remember how to get to it properly. There we go. Yeah, nice bit of bounty back there. And save. I didn't even need to use my new blood save. Yet again, I just kind of Spam the stopwatch the entire time. So I guess I wasn't really skillful either. Yet again, I can't say I really feel bad for doing it. This placement of some of these enemies is eh. Yet again, it might just be because I've been playing for like, how many hours straight now? Five, going on six. Whoa. Ah. Nope, oh, okay. First time I fell to death on the clock tower. in both playthroughs. Nah. Uh, 
down here? Yeah, it's this money. Not me, I'll probably get that too. Huh? Oh. Yeah. Imp projectiles. It's kind of wondering what was damaging there. Damaging me there for a minute. My words, they're getting slurred. This is what happens when you spend five hours straight streaming and playing games. Setting a scummy save right here. No. Whatever, I'm using the scummy save. The hell is that? Game's taking a 64 bit chip. Yeah, I'm really glad I kept the stopwatch now. Watch that sniper will. Okay, two snipers. Mm hmm. <laughs> Alright. I just gotta wait for this duder to come over here. Well, you know, he could just not. likes a lag there for some reason. I think that may deserve another scum save. Just so I don't have to deal with that every time. Yep, okay. Yeah. And I could probably just let him go, but... Oh wow, that time he didn't even go towards the elevator. Again! Oh wait! Nope, that time he... Oh, okay.
Uh, I guess this is the game's way of saying fuck you and your stopwatch. Alright, well, if you're gonna play it that way, play it my way. I don't even know why I'm killing the bone filler. I'm doing a lot of saves scumming right now. Son of a bitch. Son of my bitch. And the snipers are a reason I really can't rush this either. Or the reason or they're the reason I can't slow down. I'm sorry, not rush. Oh boy. I know nothing can get me in here, so I should be safe in this location. Well, actually, I could save that under current position. <laughs> I think I may have screwed myself here. These gastropods pick the worst spot to hang out in. It's like you have all these machines and stuff going. Just you worried about your little spore babbies getting splattered everywhere? Oh god, I almost fell off. I do not know how I'm going to get out of this bit. Oh wait, this is out. Yeah, well, there goes my... Oh, okay, I did it. Never mind. I was going to say, there goes my chances of killing the sniper. Oh. There's another one, never mind. Eh. 
Big heart. Ah, crap. Nah, this money. Big heart. Yeah. Big heart. <laughs> no. Oh, hello. How am I still alive? Ah, oh, man, I'm almost there, too. Watch, I'll probably be like a flea man or something around this corner here. And that's what'll get me. No, not a bat. Please, not a bat. I'll get to refuel my everything here and Dracula's in there. I have a feeling the hard RNG could have been a little better there. Ow. Oh. Ah, okay, there is this room. Yeah, I'm not grabbing that. Oh. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I guess I will be grabbing that. I mean, both are good items. Uh, save one here just in case. Yeah, it does want to finish this. So ends the great battle. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, I think I may have wanted to cross this. Actually, you know, yeah. Kill me. Stop hell? Okay. Really? If I'm hugging him, the fireball attack can't hurt me? Ow. Oh, I gotta reload the old save. You know, I never got to see what's in that room beyond the throne. I want to check that out. Ah, it's just his coffin. Okay. My curiosity has been... has been fulfilled. Really, you're just gonna do the homing fireballs now? Until I get hit. Yeah, okay. Oh, he better not do a homing fireball attack. Alright.
Over here, big boy. <laughs> Alright, this will probably be the form I die on. Let's see, I've been able to do it. I've been able to do this battle just fine. Man, he doesn't even hold still now. I guess that's another major change in his boss fight. Yep, called it. I'm dead. Yep. Good use of that. Ta! Or not. Holy shit. Impossible. Not this time. Man, I really feel really dirty for a save scumming like that. But hey, at least I can say I beat the Blood Moon difficulty in one setting. Yeah, I can't go back. Alright. Alright. And that is another wad down. I'm gonna say down the toilet. But that doesn't sound right. That's another Doom map set completed. There we go. Yeah. It's still fun, even with the annoying enemy placement near the end of the game. I mean, at least they give you the stopwatch. I'd still probably be struggling with that if it wasn't for the stopwatch being at the beginning. And that is Castlevania Simon's Destiny. Super fun map set overall. Even if I did start to save scum towards the end. I still had fun playing it. All within two hours.
And in the morning, I will be having a word with Comcast. Really wanted to finish this on stream. But my upload speed keeps going to shit. Thanks, Comcast.